Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem which is x over 2 bracket power of 6 is equal to 3 power of 6 to find the values of x from this equation. Now, solution. From our problem which is x over 2 bracket power of 6 is equal to 3 power of 6 in the first step from this part here is in the form of a over b bracket power of x which is equal to a power of x over b power of x so by applying this rule in this form here to be x power of 6 over 2 power of 6 is equal to this 3 power of 6 which is same as over 1 so into here we'll cross multiply so it will be x power of 6 times 1 it is x power of 6 is equal to 2 power of 6 times 3 power of 6 so 2 power of 6 times 3 power of 6 then it will be x power of 6 is equal to into here 2 power of 6 times 3 power of 6 this part here is in the form of a power of x times b power of x which is equal to a times b bracket of x so we'll apply this form here so it will be 2 times 3 then bracket common power of 6 so it will be x power of 6 is equal to 2 times 3 it is 6 power of 6 then we'll take this 6 power of 6 into the left side so it will be x power of 6 this will take this side to be minus 6 power of 6 is equal to 0 then it will be x power of 6 6 is same as 3 times 2 minus 6 power of 6 6 is same as 3 times 2 is equal to 0 now from this part here and this part here is in the form of x times a x power of a times b which is equal to x power of a inside the bracket power of b outside the bracket so we'll apply this form here so it will be x power of 3 inside the bracket power of 2 outside the bracket minus 6 power of 3 inside the bracket power of 2 outside the bracket is equal to 0 now from here now is in the form of difference of 2 squares so we'll apply difference of two squares rule, which is a square minus b square is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a minus b bracket. So from this our equation here, it will be, we'll apply this from here of a plus b, it will be x power 3 plus 6 power 3. So here x power 3 plus 6 power 3 bracket then bracket a minus b it will be x power of 3 minus 6 power of 3 so x power of 3 minus 6 power of 3 bracket is equal to 0 then from here we have two solutions whereas first solution is this which is x power of 3 plus 6 power of 3 is equal to 0 and the second solution is x power of 3 minus 6 power of 3 is equal to 0 now from this first solution here x power of 3 minus plus 6 power of 3 this part here is in the form of a power of 3 plus b power of 3 which is equal to a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket so here a plus b it will be x plus 6 so here x plus 6 bracket bracket a square it will be x square then minus a b it will be x times 6 is 6 x plus b square it will be 60 square bracket is equal to this 0 now also from this second equation here x power 3 minus 6 power 3 is in the form of a power of 3 minus b power of 3 which is equal to a minus b bracket then bracket a square plus 
a b plus b square bracket so here a minus b it will be x minus 6 so here x minus 6 bracket bracket a square it will be x square then plus a b it will be x times 6 is 6 x plus b square it will be 6 square bracket is equal to this zero then in the next step from this first solution here which is x plus 6 bracket bracket x square minus 6x plus 6 square is 36 bracket is equal to 0 and from this second solution here which is x minus 6 bracket bracket x square plus 6x plus 6 square is 36 bracket is equal to this 0 so from here we have two solutions whereas first solution is x plus 6 is equal to 0 and second solution is x square minus 6x plus 36 is equal to 0 now from this first solution here we take 6 to the right side so it will be x is equal to negative 6 so this is the first solution or first answer which is real solution now to solve from this quadratic equation we'll use quadratic formula so from quadratic formula which is x is equal to minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a then it will be x is equal to minus b b is coefficient of x which is negative 6 so here it will be negative 6 bracket plus or minus square root of b square b square it will be negative 6 square bracket square then minus 4 times a is 1 times c is 36 then over 2 times a is 1 then it will be x is equal to negative and negative 6 it is positive 6 plus or minus square root of negative 6 square is positive, positive 36 then minus 4 times this 36 then over 2 then it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root from here 36 is common so 36 we take out of bracket this divided by this is 1 minus 4 times 36 divided by 36 is minus 4 bracket then over 2 then it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 times 1 minus 4 is minus 3 so minus 3 is same as 3 times negative 1 then over this 2 then it will be x is equal to 6 plus or minus square root of 36 it is 6 times this square root of 3 square root of negative 1 it is i then we divide by 2 in both parts so divide by 2 in here and here divide by 2 so it will be x is equal to 6 divided by 2 is 3 plus or minus 6 divided by 2 is 3 times this square root of 3 times i so into here we have two solutions which are complex solutions now let's solve from this second solution here into here we have two solutions where this first solution of x minus 6 is equal to 0 and we have the other solution which is x square plus 6x plus 36 is equal to 0. So from here we turn negative 6 to the right side. So it will be x is equal to 6. So this is the real solution. Now let's solve from this quadratic equation. We'll use quadratic formula to find the values of x which is equal to negative b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ac over 2a 
so it will be x is equal to negative b b is coefficient of x which is 6 plus or minus square root of b square it will be 60 square minus 4 times a it is 1 times c is 36 then over 2 times a is 1 then it will be x is equal to negative 6 plus or minus square root of 60 square is 36 then minus 4 times 1 times 36 is same as minus 4 times 36 then over 2 so it will be x is equal to negative 6 plus or minus square root from here 36 is common so we'll take 36 out of bracket this divided by this is 1 minus 4 times 36 divided by 36 is minus 4 bracket over this 2 so it will be x is equal to minus 6 plus or minus square root of 36 times 1 minus 4 is minus 3 which is minus 3 same as 3 times negative 1 then over 2 then it will be x is equal to minus 6 plus or minus square root of 36 it is 6 times this square root of 3 square root of minus 1 is i then we divide by 2 in this part and this part so here divide by 2 and here divide by 2 so it will be x is equal to negative 6 divided by 2 it is negative 3 plus or minus 6 divided by 2 is 3 times square root of 3 times i so from here we have complex two complex solutions therefore our conclusion the first value of x is equal to this negative 6 and here we have 6 so for, we have real solutions first value of x is negative 6 the second value of x is equal to 6 these are real solutions now these are complex solutions so the third value of x is equal to here when it is positive to be 3 plus 3 square root of 3i so 3 plus 3 square root of 3i the fourth value of x is equal to when it is negative it is 3 minus 3 square root of 3i the fifth value of x is equal to here it will be minus 3 plus 3 square root of 3i so minus 3 plus 3 square root of 3i and the sixth value of x is equal to here when it is negative it is minus 3 minus 3 square root of 3i so here minus 3 minus 3 square root of 3i so these are all the six values of x in this our problem whereas we have two real solutions and four complex solutions thank you for watching don't forget these steps to miss out subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video bye bye